Brothers, this is Aurora. Within the last few hours, traitor forces have arrived in their hundreds and commandeered the facility. Commandeered? Where is Luz? Inside. They have the facility, Luz, and the power source. Holy terror. Perhaps you were right, Titus. What's up, theoretical? We've diverted all available forces to the Merium, but we're well below full strength. We've prepared an assault, but it has little chance of success, unless we take care of this. They're using it to draw in reinforcements. For every one of them we kill, two more show up in their place. It's heavily guarded. I'll need a combat squad, five men. I can spare three men. Next. The enemy seem to be drawing their power from this structure. What is it? We don't know. Every attempt to bring it down has failed. Your squad has developed a reputation for unconventional approaches. Any ideas? I've read of Demerion. It's a burial world. 4,000 years ago, there was a clash between the Ultramarines and the Heretics. The Sword of Atreus, a battle barge wrecked in the fighting, was laid to rest here. What of it? Records state that while its body was ruined, its engines burned bright, even as it was interred. It may not fly, but it might ram. A long shot, to say the least. Worth a try. Very well, then. Navigation systems are probably dead. We can't afford to miss. He's right. Someone will need to get close to the target and place a beacon. Our offensive launches in 90 minutes. The Emperor guide you, brothers. And you, sir. Lieutenant Titus, see me on the crew deck at once. As you wish, Chaplain. Ensure brothers Chiron and Gadriel are in attendance. Inform Thunderhawk pilots that all flight paths will be extremely hostile. Will it hold? Using an ancient battle barge as a battering ram. An unorthodox approach. You disapprove. On the contrary, it is inspired thinking. I reluctantly second that. Why reluctantly? Because it will go to your head. I am troubled by a report I have received from the Astro Telepathica. An accusation of heresy. Her voice was puppeted by a... The lieutenant will answer. The Psycho was possessed. Your sergeant believed otherwise. I was mistaken. You attempted to incapacitate your lieutenant. Thank the Emperor I failed. And now, the only individual capable of reaching Lord Kelgar is dead. By your hands, I will be watching all of you. Should I suspect even a flicker of corruption, I will not hesitate as you did. You are dismissed. Brother, what was spoken by the chaplain? Brothers, we have arrived at the burial. Lord Thunderhawks immediately and prepare for assault. Time to go.
enemy have amassed the majority of their forces in the Numerellian Basin. Thalassa has the warp beacon. Viridian is hoping for a miracle. The rest of us will move to clear the reliquaries around the basin and establish a beachhead. We are facing overwhelming enemy numbers on Demerium, but the heretic filth down there have stirred the wrath of the Second Company. We will inflict upon the traitors such agony, the likes of which they have not seen since the burning of Prospero. They will suffer, they will break, and they will fall. Sons of Gilliman, for the glory of Ultramar! For the glory of Ultramar! Galio, theoretically, could Tacticus armor withstand a suborbital drop? Gravis is too cumbersome for our needs. Negative. Extreme risk. Dense debris fields litter the entry flight path. But if we avoid the debris, could we survive the descent? Calculating. Survival probability equal to 62.4136. Unacceptably low. Thank you, Galio. Orbital drop without Gravis armor. It is a sound strategy. With a 38% failure rate. We are facing much less favorable odds today. Brothers, our captain's words need no further embellishment. I will speak only of practical concerns. The heretics will employ absolute deception. You will be assaulted by lies and illusion. The only true ground you will find down there will be each other. Trust only your brothers and your instincts. Now go forth and lay waste to our enemies. For the Emperor! For the Emperor! this before you mean drop through an active combat zone dodging flak enemy ships and burning wreckage on the way down exactly no this will be a first the codex astartes does not support this action but i am looking forward to it stay close it's almost impossible to regroup if we're separated 60 seconds helmets Sir! I must apologize for my actions on other house. Unnecessary. I fell prey to suspicion. Almost killed you. When I was a young captain, one of my men questioned my motives, brushed his concerns aside, and I paid the price. Your suspicions arose because I failed to answer your doubts. I feel the answer is. Stand by for some orbital drop. I'm honored to fight beside you both. As are we, brother. You grew up on Kalf. Let's say we settled some of that debt today. Aye, sir. Navigate by 
We will make it. Now focus. Brother, be careful! Short work of these traitors. Quicker than they deserve. the land. Galassa, we are on the ground and moving. Report status. We are approaching the battle barge now. You are ahead of us. Make contact once the Atreus is ready to launch. It shall be done. Are we going to let them beat us to the objective, brother? Not today.
Almost there. What is your status? The sleeping giant will soon awaken, brother. Hold for our signal. Strong too now, 
as you command. Thought from Onyx, we can only be strong one. <laughs> All goes by plan. Not get past this. Restocking. Transmitting targeting signal now. Your signal barely registers, but I read it. Your data is clouded, Lieutenant. Maintain close proximity to target. <laughs> Dig in. We are pushed back. The Atreus will miss its target. We will not yield a single step. They will not deprive us of seeing that monstrosity fall. We will find no respite until that tower falls. Come! You warp tainted bastards! And die! Watch as your false idols come crumbling down! The traitors fall from their bastards! We are the 
detecting a massive energy surge from within the Aurora facility. Lose. He must be trying to use the device. Or someone else's. Whatever it is, it is unsanctioned by the Adeptus Mechanicus. Put a stop to it. Yes, Captain.
seem determined to destroy Aurora. Is it possible the device might work? That it could weaken them? Perhaps they seek only the power source. Then why would they kill Nozick? I do not know, nor do I wish to speculate. We are here to end this folly, and so we shall. Proceed. Show yourself, betrayer! What is it, brother? The artifact calls to you, Titus. Special. And I will destroy it. To whom do you speak? You do not hear him. No. Petty tricks. Death to the false emperor! Death to his puppets! We will not be disposed of so easily. Great Emperor has foreseen your doom! Mission secured. Reloading. This does not bode well. Proceed to the camp. Completely ransacked. Drone, take them all. Site of a Mechanicus macro weapon. An excavation site. Indeed. Our path leads down. Chiron to Resilient. Enter a Mechanicus dig site. Requesting relevant cartography. Restricted by order of the Adeptus Mechanicus. This is Lieutenant Titus. Request authorized. Denied. Aurora seal required. Identify yourself. Stop 
The traitor Nemoro. Do you believe it? He certainly did. You said it was destroyed. Apparently not well enough. That damnable Arch Magos. If it truly is tainted with corruption, to deploy then we must destroy it permanently. Agreed. That airlock leads into the mines. Gather inside. Entering quarantine zone. Decontamination required. Initiate biological purgation within the chamber. Microfuel index 1.2%. Initiating sterilization. Barely a sign of life on this world. It is a burial world, brother. Reserved for the dead. Microbial index reduced to 0 0.01%. It is safe to proceed. Safe. Interesting choice of words. Pity this chamber cannot remove corruption. That duty is ours. Ancient ruins. A cover for their research, perhaps. The subject of it, more likely. The figures in these carvings are unusual. Ancient marks of the ruinous powers. Edged by fools. Long before the Great Crusade illuminated this world. These were not made by devotees of the warp. How do you know? You may soon see for yourself. enemy have penetrated deep into these caverns. Perhaps all the way to the Aurora device. interest could the Mars adept have in old stone? We know not what secrets this old stone holds. I only ask that it holds our weight.
worthless life in the head. Treachery ends now. You know nothing of Brotherhood, Lieutenant. More cheap tricks. End this desecration!
Foundation Juggernaut for these traitors. Have faith, brother. We will send them to one fitting. for the real thing. I tire of chasing this bastard's phantom. Why install Aurora deep within these ruins? Perhaps it was already here. How? A relic from the Dark Age of Technology. This is heresy. They will no doubt invoke the Treaty of Mars. This damn quest for knowledge. Ekaterina Malvolos, analog backup log 8.7.A66Q. I have found an encoded set of coordinates, hidden between the lines of code. I feel the Omnisire's will guiding me now. The animus of curiosity pulls me toward a tomb adjacent to the retrieval site. I have been selected by the Machine God to decipher this riddle. Awakening will have context before the archenemy assault overtakes me. Magos Ekaterina Malvolos, analog backup log 8.7.A, 09I. No other sign of life or Xenos presence detected. Not even a servitor or servo skull. How odd. The tomb has been undisturbed for more than 60,000 years. Short life circuits. That is long. Upon further parsing, I cannot unequivocally say what awakening means, but in the desolate space where the coordinates led me, there is nothing but an ancient sarcophagus whose name is long faded from view. Even a precursory scan of Demiriums and Herd found nothing but numbers and false names. Magos Ekaterina Mulvolos Analog Backup Log 8.7.A18R. I found an uplink concealed by dust and residue along the sarcophagus space. The connection took seconds, but it passed as hours. The signal I received was that infernal word repeated over and over and over. Awakening, awakening, awakening. This was a waste of time. I shall perish, having added no new knowledge to the repository. Munition secured. Reloading weapon. How deep do these tunnels go? We shall see. Pull the elevator. Yeah. 
is almost here, with enemy reinforcements and all specs. Prepare a fitting welcome. Before. Only the mechanical horrors that spill forth from such a place. The Martians have preserved everything. This place should have been obliterated upon discovery. Listen, I crush your pathetic man machine. <laughs> On. Pay his squawking no heed, brothers. We will not be distracted from our purpose. The enemy is well ahead of us. This trail will lead us to them. The sorcerer will elude us no longer. Move on the obelisk. Speak as if you know me. Fight. 
Crush it to dust. If it has no effect on you, why not use it? You dare suggest heresy, Sergeant? I said nothing. And I heard nothing. That degenerate clouds our minds. Forgive my error. We will not let you down, brother. Have no doubt. Chaos abominations! You think so little of Sangors, of myself, of the great thing. We are of a power greater than mankind. A true divinity. When we call out to our God, they answer. When have you ever felt the light of your emperor? Centuries longer still. Eons, brother. If the archives are to be believed, and on more worlds than we shall ever wish to discover. I pray everyone is unearthed and burned to cinders. Cipher that spells awoke. 
I hear the skittering machine thing, but when I look, I am not followed. No other footprints in the dust but my own still. I am being chased. Hunted. What have I awoken? I recorded the sound. See? Where is it? Where is Zaya? I do not want to look at... Flying. Dead like vultures. Or with the Martian court sanction, no doubt. I do not think they were alone in that. Do you not see the hypocrisy of Nikea? You have felt the same betrayal of the thousands of us. They call us
Aurora. It lays waste to the heretics. Where is Imura? The traitors are taking a thrashing down there. Let us add to it. to all but his work. Thankfully, his diligence has not made him faster. Luz! Ah, Lieutenant Titus, praise the Omnisire. In just a few minutes, you will bear witness to- You must stop this! Sire, please. I know you have concerns, but look, this is merely a taste of what the device is capable of. And I have seen the worst of what it can do. My lord, you you must trust me. This has, has been my quest for knowledge. M my life's work. Shut it down. Now. I will not. Forgive me, Lord. Time will reveal the purity of my intentions. <laughs> you tiny grains of sand, prattling as you tumble. For a moment, it seems you might do my work for me. But alas, I must finish this myself. Witness true power! for you, wretched thing. Enough of these childish games! Then let us put a stop to them once and for all!
exist here! We will see. This is just the beginning! With these devices, we will seal the Great Rift and drive the heretics back into the warp! With nothing more! <laughs> the transference of a light.